High school football injury fund games are ongoing throughout the state tonight. One week from tonight, we'll be running around the state getting you all the action for the return of the Friday Night Blitz. In the interim, our team previews roll on. It's been three years since Rogers has had a winning record, but that was due in large part to being one of the smallest schools to compete in D1. Three losses by one score fueled this group in offseason workouts. Now the Vikings return to Division II with lessons they learned in those close games and ready to turn those losses into wins. We've struggled the last two years, and I think being in one taught us a lot. Um, I think I got a resilient group coming back. We think we got a good group of seniors that are leaders. Uh, we feel like, you know, we're going to be a well-balanced team. Maybe last year we, we ran the ball primarily. We're going to be able to run and throw the ball a little bit better.